On second down, here's Stafford. And he's taken down here by the Saints. Donnell Allerby from that outside linebacker spot. He's able to get in there. Breeze to throw on second down. And he's got his man in stride, complete. And he's brought down. Time running out here on the play clock. Breeze going to throw. Funches with a catch over the middle. This is dead on that play. He can hurt you downfield. He reads defenses so well, doesn't he? He really does, and the best part of half here than Drew Breeze. Yeah, he had Jimmy Graham for all those years. Ben Watts. And he'll barrel his way into the end zone for a Saint touchdown. Mark Ingram, his 21st touchdown of the season. To throw on second down at Stanford. It's complete to Golden Tate. That's something they saw a lot in 2015 in the fewest rushing yards of any team in the NFL. That's one of those dubious titles. Stafford gives to Abdullah on the draw. And he's brought down. You defend the goal line exactly the same way. They can't cross that. You play through the receivers. And on that play, that's exactly what they did. Third and long, it's Stafford. Can't find anyone open. And probably the wise decision. And at BYU, was just scratching the surface before he hit the NFL. Yeah, from Ghana, where he really likes soccer and basketball, but football's okay for him. Now Breeze on third down. And the pressure gets to a whole lot of room to ramble for him. Yeah, you're right. It's been that way all afternoon. Didn't get a whole lot better there. And I think that one might have been intercepted, but he will be ruled out of bounds. You so know, the right. rap against us defenders is that we are frustrated offensive guys who can't catch. <laughs> and he caught it. Just couldn't get his feet down in bounds. It's that second part that finished off the play for him. And it's fielded at the 34. Willie Sneed all the Second down, here's Stafford. He's got time. A dump off for Abdullah. And he'll be brought down right around Sometimes the he gets lost in the traffic a little bit. But get him out in the open field into some space. That Golden Tate's gonna go. The 20. Touchdown, Detroit. The quarterback handed it to the runner, and the tackle was there right away for a loss of yardage. It's complete. Flaner, right side. Gets it back on the field. Little surprise here on third and one. They run. It's Mark Ingram. And he's going to create a crease and allowed him to get through for a first down. He's going to float this one deep. It's caught inside the 25. Touchdown, New Orleans. And that's why they were able to get to him and hit him as he tried to throw the football and force an incompletion. Incomplete. They want to see the ball thrown and thrown well, and he's able to do that and put it in the end zone. And that's caught inside the 35. Touchdown, New Orleans. To quarter number three. Fielded about a yard deep. And now off to the races, down the right side. <laughs> Touchdown, New Orleans! The message at halftime when things are going well. You've done everything you're expected to do. How about a little bit more of that in the second half? But be aware they may throw back for him, maybe turn things around. Now he's gonna have some confidence and maybe they'll get to his normal to them if they help in the run game. And anytime you get a run of that yardage, that means the wide receivers did help. And he'll get into the end. Long pass. That maybe they just want to do that again, right? And that's exactly how you want to draw things up. Whether it's on your grease bill, no. Being a little bit facetious here, but I do know that after last week's game, the coaches the here. definitely want to play coverage here. He's got time in the pocket. It's complete to Flaner. And he's going to get the first down. Second down, the ball on the two here. Second and goal. This is Ingram. And he is in front. Talked about. They scored the last time out. They feel good about themselves. They feel like their game plan is now enough to defender towards the middle of the field to give himself space to cut to the outside and have that ball delivered with good timing. And then the field to become dependable targets for their quarterbacks and move the sticks as guys are worth their weight in goals. He's going to flip losing that. right now. Stafford looks to throw again. 
He's got time. And caught by Curley. And they're able to get this. Back to the air. Stafford on second down. That is caught inside the five. An error in the game. Where the and he's got his man. It's caught for a lion touch. And now we see why teams practice so much on the two-point conversion, why you have more than one play ready, because you may need multiple. And all deep in his own territory, he coughs up the football. So they take over, not only in it. Now Riddick. What a spin. Call it a gain of three, and it'll bring up. Desperation time for Stafford on fourth down. And Tate's got it. And he takes this one in. You like his production, his second touchdown of the game. But right now, his team is trailing. Fortunately, he's playing pretty well and trying to keep him in it. Now they might need a little more. You're going to see more people stacked up in the line of scrimmage as they try and bleed it out. Left side and caught by Feiner. And he gets here in the eye. And they'll let their fullback try and push the pile. And he 